Hi, I, um, I'm here with uh, Paul at um, uh, Dorkbot. And uh, Paul, what have you made here for us? This is a uh, LED video display. It shows uh, animated sequences. And if I, if I trigger one, then the camera might... Uh, All right, trigger away for us. Oh, wow, there you go. So what, what are you stomping on here? These are uh, these are stomp pads. And if you get this in the picture, they have these piezoelectric sensors, which are just wired into these cables. Okay. And the stomp and then, sensors. Yeah. And then what's what's taking the stomp and then actually this, feeding it into this uh, this board down here? The stomp sensors are connected to these analog amplifiers, which are also made by uh, TI. Okay, cool. These are uh, TI amplifiers, and then turn the analog signal uh, sensors into uh, a digital signal. And then this board here... That's a, that's a TT right there? Yes. Okay. And it's running Arduino open source code, and that code... And, then, uh, and that's all fit in here to a USB hub talking right. to uh, the BeagleBone Black. Right, so the BeagleBone is receiving the sensor data. And then it has animated GIF files on the BeagleBone. And, and that so is that software that you wrote that uh, yes. plays the animated GIF files? Absolutely, yes. Okay, so that's but that's available on your website, right? For anybody. That's to on the Dorkbot website. It's open source. It's totally free, and it uses the libgif library to read the GIF files into memory. And then when it hears these triggers, it uh, plays the data on. It sends the data out to these ports up here, which stream the data out to the LEDs. Okay, cool. And so you got. More of these little these teensies here wiring out to these uh, LED arrays, right. and so you can feed in all, all sorts of data. So you're feeding in animated gifs right now, but you can feed in all sorts of data to these guys, right? So right. you're telling me earlier you've also got a USB webcam up here, right? Right. Um, so you could, so you're able to, to plug that in and actually feed live video to the LED array as well. Absolutely. In fact, the BeagleBone comes with the video for the video for Linux APIs and uh, libraries on the BeagleBone in the default BeagleBone installation. It comes Excellent. with the video libraries necessary. So how long did it take you to put this together? Well, uh, a few months ago I started working on this library and this was created first. Okay. We, uh, we spent about two weeks building the stomp pads. Okay. And, uh, it took me I prototyped the code on my desktop PC, and it took me about half a day to get it working on the BeagleBone. So if I wanted to find out more about this, where can I go to find more information? Well, we have it here on the handout. This is, uh, I don't know if you can get this URL on your camera. All right, I'll try. Oh, there it goes. All right, so Dorkbot PDX blog. Thanks.